they win all three games, they get 15 more points. Will 65 be enough? Maybe, maybe not. But it all starts here for them today. And this is the sort of environment where they really thrive. If the game opens up, Harlequins are very, very strong. But how very, how often do you like to be Saracens guys let a game open up? Very rare. It is rare indeed. And a rare sight to see Mako Bunapola leading out the team, but he's um, enjoying his promotion. He's become a, a key man in their operation. Only the second prop to lead Saracens out in a premiership. And a big day for him. He's earned it. He's earned his spurs both with club and with country. And a proud moment for Mako Bunapola. Firepower pretty much everywhere. We mentioned, Lawrence, that they've been firing on all cylinders since the Six Nations, but we have to say last weekend, that quarter-final of the Champions Cup against Saints, certainly the first half, they were actually quite a long way below par. Second half comeback was impressive. They were below par, but they showed a different side to Saracens all season. They showed that they've got the resilience and the character and the strength to come from behind when they're under pressure. And such has been their dominance across the Viva Premiership. I think they've led for nearly every single round that they can afford to lead. The likes of Owen Farrell and Mara Toji on the, uh, well, back on the sofa at home. Safely tucked up for next weekend's big clash.